You're witnessing one of those miracles of science. It's curving like, a little bit like this way. Yeah. So, it's okay. What, it must be a banana. Do? <laughs> this man can see again, at least somewhat, all thanks to a groundbreaking retinal implant. Research teams in Germany have been working on a way to combat a genetic disease that kills off light-sensitive cells in the eye, leaving the person blind. They came up with an electronic chip that's implanted in the retina. The device then captures images using an external camera mounted on a pair of glasses, and a signal is sent to the brain. So very similar, very similar profile to prosthetic ears or prosthetic eyes. And you can see from this video, the guy could tell an apple from a banana, but not very well, right? So once again, very low fidelity. Once again, there's no output to it, it's input only. And the same idea of low to medium, um, low to medium belief and immersion. I think what they found so far with, um, with visual implants is that um, people haven't said yet, well, I'd rather just be completely blind than have this thing um, because there's, you know, it allows them to navigate through the world where people who have no hearing, they can navigate through the world very well and they've learned very well how to communicate. And so I think it's a little different scenario for the, for the cochlear implant than it is for the uh, optical implants and that they have a little bit more belief and immersion that this is a world that I'm going to live in from now on. Um, but anyway, those are two, you know, those, that's sort of the state of art, the state of the art for augmenting your inputs.